goes berserk. Hey everybody. Um, yeah, as things go, it seems like week to week, I'm picking up another FJ. Uh, we're gonna drive two hours in Nora, and we're gonna go pick up another one, I think. Uh, this one's awesome. It's got a old first gen ARB roof rack, lifted 33s, and a whole bunch of spare parts. So, uh, two hour drive, here we come. Let's go check out another one. Well, we're a couple miles away from the truck. It's always interesting how these trucks find me. Uh, yesterday, I got a text, just like usual, of a link, always floating around with links, and it was a Land Cruiser that was online for 30 minutes. Uh, a gentleman that I put a suspension lift on his FJ62 sent it to me, and I instantly reached out, biting my nails the whole time, this guy would get back to me. It took all day, and this morning I woke up to, it's a pending sale. So, it is a pending sale with somebody else, but he said I could come look at it and I have a feeling he's gonna let me take it home. So that's super exciting. We're about two miles out. Let's get over there and see what this truck's all about. There she is. Holy smokes, she's beautiful. Oh my gosh, that is a beautiful truck. Well, the deed is done. We're out here in the middle of nowhere, Charlottesville, Virginia area, and we just picked up another 1986 Toyota Land Cruiser. Uh, it does have some issues with the motor, it has some blow-by, but it does run and will be able to be driven onto a trailer. Uh, Mike and I are gonna be coming here later this week to trailer her home, because that is about a two, two and a half hour ride in the 60, so I doubt the truck would make it that long. I really gotta put some time into it to see what specifically is wrong with it, but. It is very clean, cleaner than Mr. Uh, Blue here. Uh, but the owner, Cliff, he did give me a few things to make the trip way worth it. One of the most genuine people I've ever met. He gave me this sweet hat, which I'm really excited about. And then he gave me a really special beer that's actually an aged beer. I've never had anything like that before. He said, drink it on a special occasion. So we'll see when we're gonna drink that. He gave me a ton of spare parts, as you can see. Um, and he says he has a ton more for when we pick it up. So he's gonna clean the truck out. will be ready for us to pick up on Wednesday. I am so stoked and I can't wait to dig into this one. So you ready to get another cruiser?
So unfortunately, we couldn't get a whole lot of footage of it going on the trailer. Couldn't get it started, but the owner, Cliff, had the last plan. We took the winch that's on the front, used a battery charger to run the battery for the winch, and then we took the winch cable and ran it all the way under the truck, all the way back to the Toyota Tundra, and then winched it on backwards with its own winch. So first time putting on a uh, truck that way, but it definitely worked out really well. Um, definitely one from memory books. Now we just gotta get back to my place and then somehow get it off the trailer. Hey there guys, just want to say if you really liked the video, I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe, like, and share it. Uh, it really helps motivate me to put more content like this together for you, as well as pick up more rigs. So, till next time, appreciate all the support so far, and I'll catch you in the next video.